Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. A Muslim student in India was called terrorist by his lecturer in the classroom in front of his friends and he responded back and made him apologize. Let's listen. Yes, sir, it's not funny. Being a Muslim in this country and pacing all of this every day is not funny. That's like my son. No, no, no. Will you talk to your son like that? My son. Will you, will you name? Will you call him by the name of a terrorist? No. Khalas. How can you call him like that? No problem. In front of so many people in no, a class. Sorry, I told you. You are a professional. You are yeah, teaching. Yeah, yeah, sorry, it's not. You can't call me that. Sorry, I told you. Are you? Sir, sorry doesn't change how you think or how you portray yourself here. Masha Allah, this. Brother, he has responded back, he has shown him his place, no matter whoever it is, it's your lecturer or it's your friends or it's whoever, even if it's the government, if they do anything wrong, if they accuse you wrongly, then you should stand up and retaliate and show them their place. Because we Muslims are accused of the things that we never did. They just generally call us whatever they want. So they should be taught a lesson. May Allah give this brother Izza. May Allah give him honor. May Allah make him a righteous human being. And may Allah make him the flag bearer of Islam. May Allah make our youths the flag bearer of Islam. In India in recent times we have seen a lot of oppression happening to the Muslims. Even sometimes the government itself supports oppression of the Muslims. Sometimes the Indian media also supports the oppression. And we have seen how the Muslims are suffering in different states of India. There are around more than 200 millions of Muslims in that country. But still many of them are not having proper human rights. The rights of a cow is bigger than the rights of Muslims there. May Allah give us understanding. May Allah enhance the knowledge of our youths. And may Allah make them righteous and pious.